Hello and welcome to a couple of days in my life, work edition, work travel edition. I am obviously still at home, currently planning out the outfits and about to pack. This is Sebastian's tiny little carry-on suitcase, which is perfect. I don't have a checked bag or anything, um, so we gotta fit everything basically into there. Plus, I'll be carrying my book bag with me. Uh, so I can have like my laptop in there and that will go under the seat in front of me, you know? Usually I, I never, ever, ever put something in the overhead cabinets, you know? What are they called on the airplane? I don't know, but I, I usually never stow anything overhead because I'm short and putting stuff up there and taking stuff down from there is very uncomfortable. And I like to have everything that I like need within hands reach you know like if I want my book if I want my water or laptop or something I like it right there where I can access it um but let's let's get started it's a business casual this we're not going to our office this is actually like a resort and we're doing our company all hands so, so literally the whole company is going to be there um aside from like a couple of people wearing those on the airplane it is business casual but like I think these are fine I used to wear these at work all the time at my old job the other thing is like we're, we're gonna be hanging around all day you know like I want to be pretty comfortable and today is Sunday so flying out on a Sunday my flights actually at like 5 p.m. I'm one of the last people to get there tonight so that's really fun everybody else is gonna be there at like 12 p.m. 1 2 3 4 I'm gonna be there I'm gonna get to the actual resort at like 8 something which sucks but it's fine uh, but what I was saying is I'm leaving Tuesday so it's really just two nights and then I leave Tuesday at like also 5 p.m. I'm bringing an extra shirt in case I'm not sure which outfit I want to go with hours later but I'm putting final thing in my little carry-on that would be my flat iron straightener whatever you want to call it I am bringing my curling iron as well I just used this so I had to wait well I didn't just use it but I had to wait for it to cool down a bit I should be good I'm also you know still in the states people have cars that they're taking so like, if I absolutely needed something, I would be okay, but it should be good. This is so cute. Okay, that's that. Let me, let me do a practice run. Okay, I'll be walking through the airplane. Oh, there's my seat. Put that down. Okay. I got this. That's fine. She's a little heavy, but nothing that I can't handle. Also, taking a book bag. Um, these are like my toiletries. And I have like an extra sweatshirt in here. It's going to be kind of cold, like 40. I'm going to be in the DMV area, so like Virginia, really. And, um,. It's gonna be kind of chilly, but I'm bringing like my flannel jacket, a light jacket, and then a sweatshirt in my book bag. And it, yeah, I think I should be good. I'm leaving in about an hour. No, I should probably leave sooner than that. Like just in case. Atlanta's airport has been, the security has been backed up apparently. So yeah, but first I'm not wearing this. So let me change right now. All right, this is the fit. These pants are from Hollister. I love them so much. They're linen cargo pants. They're literally the best. Like you can dress them up, you can dress them down. I, the last couple times that I've flown, I have, I have worn these. I got them in a pair, uh, gray pair as well. Um, but yeah, they're so comfortable and they just are really flattering. Uh, also, they're the appropriate length for being 
super short. My top is Skims. I can't remember which style. Like every day? I don't know. It's the one that kind of feels like a workout material. Um, this little jacket is from Halara. And then my Nike bolts because these are like, I'm going to wear these all day tomorrow. If we, if I go to the gym while I'm there, we're doing a walk while we're there. So yeah. And this is probably going to like go around my waist. Maybe we'll see. As far as filming over there, I'm not going to bring my big camera just because I don't want anybody to see it. Um, co-workers specifically some some of them know I have a channel they don't like say anything but it would just be a weird conversation you know um so I think I'm gonna bring my GoPro the quality isn't as up there as I, I prefer for it to be but that's okay Here's the room. I can show y'all later. I am about to go down to dinner. From my understanding, it is outside. So I need to layer up. All right, not the best look, but we're we need to be warm because I will be freezing. I am like literally the last person here. Hey y'all. So back in my room, I was downstairs. We, we first were outside and then it was really cold out. So we came inside after some time, but I met every, it wasn't that bad. Like walking into everybody wasn't so bad. It, yeah, I'm closer to certain people at the company, you know, than like I know my team. So I made a point to like go around to all the groups because everybody was in like different groups. So um, it wasn't so bad because I didn't get there while everybody was like sitting formally at dinner or anything. It was more so like going, yeah, group by group. Uh, so it wasn't as bad. And I was not the last person because somebody like drove in today. I mean, there's people who aren't here even today, like they're coming tomorrow. I don't drink but everybody else does not have most people don't heavily but some people do you know like yeah <laughs> it's not um something i prefer like i just don't see why people do that you know like i don't know you gotta just be careful but nothing crazy um but yeah i was chatting for the most part with the same few people and yeah I just I really like the team here so it was just it was just fun but I'm in bed I am very tired but I think I'm gonna read it's only like 10 30 10 42 and then I'm waking up at 6 30 because we're actually going on like a walk hike one of the owners of the company she's like <laughs> leading leading the walk in the morning at 7 a.m so I'm gonna wake up and do that Here's day one, full day one, the only full day actually. This is the outfit. Um, so far, loving everyone. This morning, we did go on that nice walk. It was beautiful. We got to kind of see the, the sunrise. Um, I'm about to go down to breakfast. It's 8, 11. Breakfast is from like eight to, to nine. Well, it's like in the room basically. And then we're starting at nine. So wanna make sure I get in there and get my food. But before I go down, I did want to mention Ana Luisa because I 
have a couple of new pieces and I just want to give an update on like the quality like I've been wearing I have so many pieces of jewelry from them like everything that I'm wearing is basically in Elisa. Since I'm filming on my GoPro I'm not going to be able to get the best shots here so I'll have to film at home some up close shots but I always am wearing these rings you'll probably see them in these videos as well as in my finance videos. I literally wear these every single day and I've had these for, for months. Uh, I actually go through phases with rings where it's like I will wear them every single day for months and then uh, not wear them for, for months. It just depends because sometimes I like, I mess with my fingers so much with them on that I start to get annoyed with myself, but um, I do love them. And I actually, I really want, there's one from Ana Luisa. It's like this black ring, it's gold, but there's like a black face on it and it's really, really cute. I can put up a picture. I would like to get that piece, but more recent, I've had these for some time. There's no like tarnishing or anything, which is crazy to me. These are not like solid gold, but they're gold coated. And typically from if it's gold coated from other brands or like some cheaper version, then it starts to wear off or like it just doesn't look right. But yeah, everything still looks really quality. I did get a couple, oh my necklaces, duh. I have seen people ask like if I can, if you can wear these while working out or going swimming or whatever. Like yes, I literally, now I have this second chain. <laughs> I can't remember the exact name of it, but it's like this little chain necklace and I love it because it's like, it's right in line with this one. Y'all know I always wear my evil eye necklace as well. That's not Ana Luisa, unfortunately. That's, that's from a different country, so that's aside the point. But I literally wear this one non-stop like this is like the little snake chain i'll put up the exact names on the screen i'm sorry i don't remember the exact names but y'all have seen me wear this for years i wear it when i work out i wear it when i shower i wore it on all of my recent vacations so i was in the beach i was in the pool i was hiking like literally exposed to all the elements i put a ton of sunscreen on and it's still looks perfect which is crazy i did not think that would happen especially i remember wearing this in hawaii and like putting a ton of sunscreen on i'm like oh this is gonna ruin it but it didn't the only time i take it off is when i go to get a massage or go to the chiropractor because obviously they're like rubbing on your neck but aside from that i don't take it off and then more recently i got these little dangle earrings these ones up front but all three of these on the bottom are anna luisa I love them. They have tons of options for you to choose from. You can either choose like little hoop ones or um, if you prefer just like a regular earring, then that's on there. I, I love little hoops with the like some sort of charm on it. So my little Papillon butterfly ones, um, I got these a while back if y'all remember. Um, but yeah, I wear them every single day. I do switch them up, which I love. So like even like the placement, because uh, I have so many ear piercings, even the placement of them I'll switch up. Like I'll put these dangle ones in the second and third hole and then this like hoop in the front, but it doesn't matter. Like they're all just great quality and so beautiful. I always get compliments on my jewelry. So um, yeah, love Ana Luisa and I really appreciate them for sending me these couple of pieces. Quick little update on all of this. Ana Luisa is actually having a sale currently for the month of November and you can get up to 30% off. So you can still use my link down below in the description box, but you'll see once you get there that you can get up to 30% off when you bundle purchases. Um, but I, I can't recommend them enough. If y'all have any questions about specific pieces that I own, feel free to ask, but I am looking forward to growing my collection because there's a couple more pieces that I have my eye on. I feel like it really completes the look. It like pulls everything together because it, kind of dresses things up, you know, like this looks so much better than if I, if I didn't have it, like it would just be, it would just be plain. So love it. We are off. I'm still going to wear these shoes. They did get a little dirty outside, but we'll work on that. Okay. My stomach is literally growling. So I'm going to go. For this thing, what, one red, one red, but anyway, for an example, if it was like this or no, if it was like this, um, she would have one because the next one is the green. But if you just have to go past that one around. Good morning, y'all. Today is Tuesday. And just getting ready for the day. I went to the gym this morning with a couple of guys. Um 
we did like full body. It was actually really fun. Just a few like, we did legs, back, shoulders, chest. I guess that's it. Uh, it was really fun. And I'm glad we went down. Usually, I'd never work out in the morning, you know, but I felt good to, to do that. And um, just like having them there was like, okay, I can do this. <laughs> but yeah, that was cool. I do need to pack everything up. I have to like check out of my room. It's only like eight in the morning, so I have time, but I need to go to breakfast. And then um, like we are, our meetings start at nine. So just gotta want time to eat breakfast. I slept much better last night. The night before I did not sleep well. So thank goodness for that. Thank you. Hi y'all and happy Sunday. Well, this is quite a bit later than the last clips that you would have seen. I decided to combine my work vlog with this video just because I didn't film too much for that video. So today we are putting up our Christmas tree. We actually just built this little console thing. He shut the doors. Looks like that. It's pretty cute. Put the TV up. It's at a good height. We have like Christmas live jazz. Um, there's the old TV console, so we posted that for sale. Oh, and then we have the same little thing over here, but for coffee. It's a bit of a mess right now, but you can see without this, it's just for our um, coffee stuff in the morning. And just yesterday, we went to Hobby Lobby, picked up a 7.5 foot Christmas tree. Both of us have never had, well like, when I lived with my sister, and obviously growing up, I had a Christmas tree, but I haven't had a Christmas tree in years because I lived in my apartment and um, never set one up. And yeah, this is obviously our first Christmas tree together. It's so exciting, and then uh, I have a ton of ornaments, so I can. I think I've shown them in videos before, but we did end up buying this little guy as well at Hobby Lobby, just to represent like our house and our first Christmas together in the house. So maybe we'll start buying an ornament every year, I don't know. But it lights up, how cute. And then I have tons of ornaments from growing up, like almost every year I would get a new one. Um, even still, like pretty frequently, my mom like gifts us a new one each year and they're all unique. So I'm excited to see what that will be like.
things to catch all up on not gonna do that in this video but you can see I bought a love sack I got bookshelves <laughs> um, but I mean that's that's really it like I just got a couple things I actually filmed a video setting this up setting up my bookshelves and then I'll probably it's just gonna be kind of like a book vlog maybe like putting my bookshelf books on the bookshelf but it wasn't that great <laughs> And then um, I did purchase a few books with gift cards. I had $75 worth of Amazon gift cards. So I bought a few books and I need to show y'all. But that'll be a different video. I just was, I was reading on here. Currently I'm reading. They both die at the end. And then I fell asleep. I took a nap. And today is the first day of daylight savings time or like the opposite whatever the opposite day is so it's already five o'clock somehow today was very busy but I mean I guess the time went fairly slow but we did a lot so just took up the day and now the sun is like already setting at 5 p.m. but we're probably gonna go on a walk in a bit Sebastian and I and I really I just have so much to do and it's really frustrating because um, I just start to get overwhelmed. But one thing I really need to do is edit this video. So that's what I'm going to start doing. Well, probably after we take our walk. I have a lot of videos to edit for my finance course that I've been working on. The plan was to launch that actually in like a few days. But that's not going to happen. Like it's probably going to be um, <laughs> hopefully within a couple of weeks. But it has to be this month because I keep saying that I'm going to launch it in November. But yeah, I'm kind of annoyed because... It's just like, I still need to clean upstairs, finish my laundry, meal prep, edit videos. It is a four day work week though, which is nice. I have off on Friday. Anyways, I know this video was super random, but thank you so much for watching. Thank you again to Ana Luisa for sending me a couple of pieces and y'all can go check out the sale that they're currently having. But otherwise, again, thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next one.